studio today, Jen Shaw. How are you, Jen? I'm good, thank you. Oh, that's good. Happy and joyful I am. I'm, I'm, I'm happy and joyful. Thanks for asking. Now, you've come into the studio, you, you contacted me on Facebook. Yep. You're an author. I am, yes. This is your second book? Second book, second hard copy book. Second hard copy book. Um, yeah. I've got a couple of e-books around, but um, this is probably my favourite book, I think. Okay, right. Yes. What was your first one called? Um, lovely Little Lunch Boxes. So it's all lunchbox stuff for kids. Make oh, it easy okay. for parents. Excellent, yes. excellent. Okay. And this one's called Living Living on Little, Real Food on a Budget. Yes. So your second book, and um, this is your draft copy here, but yep. they're all at the printers at the moment. Yes, yeah, they're on their way any day now. I'm so excited. Right, right. Yes. Hard cover. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Okay. What's inspired you to, to write? Where did it all come from? Tell me what happened. Um, I've been doing, I've been blogging and sharing things on the internet for a lot of years now. And I've been around Toowoomba doing workshops talking about paleo for a long time. Yep. Um, and I, I'd speak with a lot of people and people say, you know, how do you afford it? We're a family of nine, we've yep. got seven kids. And um, the biggest barrier we find with people is cost. Mm -hmm. You know, people think um, healthy food has to be superfood or totally organic and all these buzzwords that we've got around. So I really just um, want to help break down barriers with people. Yep. Um, make it seem easy because it is easy when you get down to it. Um, I grew up in a family of meat and three veg and nothing yep. too fancy, nothing too complicated. Yeah, um, yep. And that's the best food, you know, natural flavour is really the best. So I started a little challenge in May, a free challenge for people living on little, we called it. Okay. And through those 30 days, we just sent out tips and ideas and recipes for people um, and we put a, a version of this book together okay. and we had so much great feedback people found they were able to, we talked about meal planning, meal prepping, buying local, going to your farmers markets, yep. keeping chalks, cooking from scratch and we just had so much great feedback and we realised, um, well I realised that I needed to bring this book to print and I mm -hmm. needed to share the message even wider than that challenge we did and okay. so the book was born. Um, it went under a massive redesign from that crappy little thing I put together right. online. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fair enough. Yeah. yeah. And who's helped you with that? Um, Zara it? England has done all our photos. She's yep. local here in Toowoomba. Okay. And she's amazing. Um, she came to my house, she has a, a little baby, and she put the baby in the pouch and she oh, would yeah. just... Um, we did the shoot over about four weeks. So, yep. um, and it's not just 33 photos we took, you know, there's probably hundreds and hundreds of photos yeah, yeah, she yeah. took, oh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> the process is. Is, is crazy, you know, we yep. do a, we would do it like 10 or 12 recipes in one day and okay, right. and outtakes and stuff. But I designed it myself yep. and I self-financed it um, and self-publishing. So there's something yep. really, you, I get to control exactly what's in the content, yep. and which is good. So 30, <laughs> in this book, 33 healthy recipes for everyday families. Yes. Okay, and that's what's on the poster there. Yep. Um, this is great. Sweet potato, bacon and apple hash. Yeah, so that's a brekkie alternative. For breakfast. Yeah, yeah, because we look at brekkies and, you know, there's lots of... Um, Yum. Yep. You know, cereals are full of lots of sugar. Yeah. And lots of nice. fortified minerals, so they're not real minerals and our body doesn't really know what to do with them. And then you've got the toast and I mean there's nothing wrong with bread and you know toast yep. if you want to have that. But a lot of the modern bread it isn't prepared properly. Yep. It's got a lot of additives in it. So um we find in my family and a lot of the people I help, if you had a brekkie that's made on beautiful real food, like yep. something so easy like a sweet potato, apple and bacon hash and, and who that's doesn't great. love bacon? Yeah. Um, you know, your day just goes better, you've got more energy, you don't not yep. snacking as much and yep. And it really helps save money too because you're not buying things to snack on for, for smoko and things like that. So building so, the, so easy and yeah, it can be done in a few minutes. Exactly. We prepare it the night before. We have our sweet potato, bacon yep. and everything chopped in the fridge. Yep. Throw it through the pan. You know, you could cook it nearly quicker than you could a piece of toast. And yeah, there you go. And, that, <laughs> and look, I'll admit, breakfast in the morning, a bit lazy. Yeah, right and, and we're all busy. And yeah. sometimes we just have to set that alarm 10 minutes earlier and just make ourselves a priority. That's a big know, thing. You know? yeah, we put yeah, food yeah. and nutrition off to the side because we're busy making money or something. When we yeah. put it into perspective, food is really important and yeah. good nutrition is important. Yeah. And it all connects to our health and our happiness. And you know that has to be the number one priority. Correct. So you're launching this book at the Birkham Wells? Yes, on the 31st of July. 31st, so Sunday week? Yes. Sunday week. So what, what, what's entailed with the book launch? What have you done? Have you hired the venue? Or? We've hired the venue. Um, yeah. Tickets are selling. We're selling those tickets really low cost, $20. $20 and that yeah. comes along for the book launch. That doesn't include a book. The books will be for sale there. Yeah. 
Um, we're putting on food from the book. Yep. Um, Sherry from Raw Ads in Toowoomba here. She's doing all the food for us. Okay. Um, we'll come along. We'll have a chat about real food. It's real. I really want it to be a celebration of yep. not just the book, but real food in general. Okay. We've right. got a lot in Toowoomba. Lots of producers. We're having Fiona May from the farmers market come Love along. Fiona. And she's coming to Great. talk about why she did it. Yep. You know, and how to find her and how to find the farmers markets oh, because. Good. That's really important too, connecting yeah. with those locals. Um, yeah. I do a workshop, so I'll be demonstrating recipes. I'll be talking about meal planning, meal prepping, okay. how we do it in our home, yeah, you know, yeah. with the kids. Okay. <laughs> um, fussy kids and fussy husbands. That's a big question people want to know. How do you get their meeting better? Right. So, so Sunday the 31st of July, tickets, yes. so get them... On the website, on so the website. barefootkitchens.com.au. Oh yeah, yeah, Barefoot Kitchens, beautiful. 20 bucks, and what time are you kicking off? On um, we're website? opening the doors at 12 o'clock for, you know, come Lunch. and have something to eat. Yeah, we're going to have the food there, but we're kicking, the, I'll start at 1 o'clock. Yeah. Um, we're finishing about 3, but knowing us, we'll probably go 2 hours yeah. over time. <laughs> okay, and you'll have the books there for sale. Yeah, definitely. So what, what are you putting on the books, how much? Um, these books are twenty four ninety five. Yep. They are twenty two ninety five if you order it with your ticket to come okay, along. So right. you can save a few dollars there. Yeah, cool, excellent. Look, really great. And look, just flipping through this, some really simple recipes. Yeah, easy. And that's what it, real food doesn't have to be. You know, yeah, lengthy, yeah, yeah. and you don't yeah. have to source a golden goose egg from the the top of Peru or something. Yep. To get, you know, it's local food. It's in season food. It's it's the food I ate as a kid and my mum ate as a yeah. kid, you know, that cooking from scratch. I think you can't yeah. go wrong cooking from yeah. scratch. Cool. Okay, so that's living on little, real food on a budget. Yep. Jen Shaw, 33 healthy recipes. So the book launch, 31st of July. Yes. At the Bourbon Wells. Get your tickets online there. So, um, oh, yeah. look, thank, and don't forget Fiona May is going to be there too. Yes, yes. And I've known Fiona for a long time. Great you know, um, I was sitting at the table when she put this farmer's market together and yeah. I just love her passion oh. for local producers, real food, where food comes from. Mm. So we share that that passion and um, I I couldn't think of anyone else oh. to bring along to talk about it, you know. And right. she's um and she's a good story too, about right? how she started it, you know, passion yeah. and local food and it, I just can't wait for her to share Excellent. what she does. Good stuff. Well, good luck with that launch and get <laughs> your tickets online Sunday the thirty first of July at Bourbon Wells. Thank you. Thanks. <laughs> If you've got any questions, uh, you've got a Facebook page? Yes, yes. Facebook, just, Barefoot Kitchen's on there as yeah, well. Yeah, Barefoot Kitchen, just Facebook, and um, Jen's very available <laughs> to talk to you. So, look, thanks for watching the show again today. If you've got any story ideas, just um, pop us an email or private message me on the Toomba 4350 yeah. Facebook page. Until next time, thank <laughs> you. The little one probably wants some, um, <laughs> wants a little bit of lunch, I yes. think. So, uh, thanks for coming in today, appreciate awesome. it. cool, thanks Take for care. having me. See you. Okay. See you guys.